what's going on it's your boy inspiration is key i'm coming at y'all with a video today hoping y'all having a good day you see where i'm at you hear where i'm at you feel me let me get up lifted off that fresh air because it feels so good i hope you've been taking care of yourself i hope you've been learning to love who you are you know loving who you are accepting who you are embracing who you are continuing to establish a true and real valuable relationship with who you are understanding that if you go into a relationship not knowing your value not loving who you are not embracing who you are the other person that you decide to get in the relationship with will subconsciously feel that so it's important that before entering a relationship you have an established knowing of who you are and you have a strong enough relationship with who you are you know what I'm saying don't go into a relationship expecting somebody to build you up because if you continue to do that you will continue to be lost and hurt so value the relationship you have with self first before you decide to make that decision but other than that i'm sending you good energy now today in this video today in this video we're going to be talking about you can't expect to grow doing what's easy you can't expect to grow doing what's easy. Now, due to society, due to how we've been conditioned over the years, we have grown accustomed to getting things pretty easily in life, pretty conveniently, you know what I'm saying? Without that much work. And see, what that does is, is that it takes away people wanting to work towards something. You know what I'm saying? To put forth time and energy into something. We feel like, oh, okay, it didn't work out, so I'm going to just move on to the next, right? And having that type of mindset will prevent you from truly experiencing things that hold value. You have to realize that if it came easy, it can go easy, right? Which means that it doesn't really have any value. If it stays around longer if it takes more time to achieve and get it that means that it took more time and energy to bring in which means that it has more value i made an instagram post saying it's easy to procrastinate and be lazy when working towards your goals but realize there's no growth in that it's easy to fall back into an old and toxic relationship you had with someone because you're comfortable with it, but realize there's no growth in that. It's easy to avoid and rationalize how you truly feel within, but realize there's no growth in that. We have to realize that the easy route isn't what's gonna bring us that sense of fulfillment, that sense of joy, that sense of liberation. We have to learn to truly endure and embrace the process of working on self, working towards a goal, building something up within self, building a relationship with self. We have to learn to work in on these things and be able to embrace the process of getting there. You know what I'm saying? Making that aspiration come true, making that relationship strong enough before entering a relationship we have to be able to endure that process if we continue to disregard this and continue to try to push this off to the side we will continue to go into relationships lost and hurt we will continue to prevent and postpone our goals from taking shape and manifesting we will continue to postpone self from being liberated and free you have to realize, man, if you continue to go on this path of life, trying to be in a mindset of denial and of avoidance and of rationalization, you will continue to never establish a true understanding or understanding of who you are and what you could possibly do in this life. It all starts with us being able to accept what, we've, what we're going through, right? You have to be able to accept that you're not doing the right thing. And that, and that takes a lot. You know, I get it. It takes a lot to even 
approach life like that. But I'm telling you, once you make that decision, you can then just start to think about and understand what you need to do in order to elevate your life to the next level. You can grow from the experience. Sorry, guys, my phone had overheated. <laughs> but like I was saying, you can grow from the experience. And that's what we want to do. That's what we want to do so that we can continue to elevate in our greatest version. So I want to remind you in this video that you cannot expect to grow doing what's easy. It's going to take you stepping outside of your comfort zone. It's going to take you doing things that you're not comfortable with, that you're unfamiliar with, that you're not accustomed to. But realize that's what growth is. You can't grow doing the same routine. You can't grow implementing the things you've been doing already. There has to be new or different change. So when we decide to approach life like that, when we decide to just endure and be able to embrace the process of things all together in all regards, we can put self on a much higher and better timeline and we could become our greatest version. So that's all I got for y'all today, man. I appreciate all the love and support. We're gonna continue to get uplifted, continue to <laughs> get uplifted because it feels so good. And it's your boy, man. Inspiration is what? What? Key, baby.